Today on Low Carb with Jennifer, I'm gonna show you how to make this keto Mexican inspired meatball soup. Hey guys, welcome back to Low Carb with Jennifer. This soup is so delicious, so much flavor. Let's get started. We're gonna start off by making the meatballs for our Mexican inspired meatball soup. And we've got one pound of ground beef and a half a pound of ground chorizo in this large mixing bowl. I'm gonna crack one egg in here. I'm gonna add a quarter of a cup of half and half, six tablespoons of almond flour, a half a teaspoon of ground cumin, a half a teaspoon of salt, and a third of a cup of chopped fresh cilantro. So that's our meatball mixture. We're gonna mix it all up and form it into meatballs. Get in there. Okay, I've got about a two tablespoon scoop here. I'm going to divide the meatballs out. I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop them all out onto this plate and then I'll roll them all up. Okay, we got our meatballs all portioned out. I'm gonna put a, a little bit of oil on my hands just so the meatballs don't stick to my hands, the beef doesn't stick to my hands while I'm rolling them. And I'm gonna roll them all into nice balls. Meatballs are ready. We're gonna set these aside and we're gonna start working on the soup. Okay, I'm heating a large Dutch oven over medium heat. I'm gonna add some oil. And I've got half a cup of onion that I'm gonna saute until it's soft. Okay, our onions are looking good, so I'm gonna add in four cloves of minced garlic. I'm gonna add a 14 ounce can of tomatoes. You can use diced or crushed. And I've got two chipotles and adobo that we've chopped up. This is gonna give a really deep, nice, spicy, smoky flavor, but it's not gonna be really spicy. This is actually a pretty common ingredient that you can find in any grocery store. Stir all of that. And I'm gonna add in four cups of beef broth. Okay, now it's time to add the meatballs to the pot. So what's great about this soup is we don't have to sear the meatballs, we just add them to the soup and they cook in the soup. Okay, we got all the meatballs in there. When you're stirring it, you just wanna be careful not to tear the meatballs up. We're gonna keep get this simmering and we're gonna let these simmer for about 20 minutes. Okay, our meatball soup is ready. I made sure to test the internal temperature of the meatballs and they are 165 degrees Fahrenheit. So we're good to go. Oops. Let's serve up some of this soup. So each serving, this makes six very generous servings. Each serving is about three meatballs. So I'm gonna ladle some soup in here. We're gonna to top it with some cauliflower rice. I'm just gonna spoon it on top. Gives the soup some body, a little more substance. And then of course, I've gotta add some cilantro because I love cilantro. Lots of cilantro. Okay, let's have a taste. I'm gonna cut into one of these meatballs. This, I've already, I've already tasted the broth. It is amazing with that, those chipotles and adobo. Let's get a taste of the soup. So good. Really good spicy flavor from those chipotles, but not too spicy. And the meatballs are nice and tender, so good. You guys are going to love this recipe. Be sure you check out this other recipe for my keto chili, it is out of this world. It uses two meats, ground beef and stew meat. It is so delicious, so be sure you check that out. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time, bye.